Hello everyone. IFIL is the first year student of MPEC Paramedical and Health Institute Radiology Department. And today in our Radiology Department's practical session, I am going to discuss about dark room in this video. A dark room is used to process photographic film to make prints and to carry out other associated tasks. A dark room's layout. The dark room must be capable of being made completely light proof and the walls should be constructed of solid concrete that have a lid box inside to store boxes of unexposed films currently in use. To make the good reflecting surface for safe light, walls and roof should be painted by white or cream enamel. Water and electrical outlets should be provided. In a dark room, there can be four kind of door system that are revolving door, single door, double door and maze. The equipments that are used in a dark room are an automatic processor, manual process unit, processing chemicals, hangers for suspending films, cassettes, film storage hopper, loading bench and cupboards. Now let us discuss about a cassette film. A cassette is designed to hold the X-ray film and intensifying screens in close contact. The front face which is of aluminium and plastic faces the tube while the other side have a sheet to lid to absorb backscatter screens and cassettes are of course made in various sizes to correspond with standard film size. The dark room have two sides, the dry bench and the wet bench. Now let us discuss about the dry side. The top of the dry bench must be large enough to accommodate the largest cassette in use when opened out. The top surface should be either of wood or linoleum. The wet bench. The wet bench is used. The processing of the film is carried out. The processing includes four steps, developing, fixing, rinsing and drying. The usual method is to use a set of tanks holding developer, rinse water and fixer and a large tank of washing the films. The processing tanks are the master tank and insert tank. The master tanks serve as a water jacket to hold the insert tanks and is usually large enough to provide space between insert tanks for rinsing and washing of films. Insert tanks. These are removable contains for the individual processing solutions, developer and fixer and the space in the master can. There are two kinds of processing that can be done on the wet side, manual and automatic. The automatic one includes a automatic processor. An automatic processor contains tanks for developer solution, fixer solution, wash tanks for water. An automatic processor prepares the film automatically without any manual help. At last, we will discuss about the lighting system and hatches used in a dark room. There are two kinds of lightings, the visible light and the safe light. The visible light is for inspection and maintenance of cassette and screens, cleaning of work surfaces, servicing of equipments, perfectly centrally placed. The safe lighting includes two methods, direct and indirect. Direct light from the space lamp direct falls onto the work surface, best for loading and unloading areas. The indirect safe lighting directs the light towards the ceiling which reflects right back into the roof. It intended to provide general illumination of the dark 